my true pleasure this morning to give you this keynote speaker. Lon Burku. Today I would like for us to look at a few things that we can do about it. We can take control, we can take action and make a difference. In a warfare, he who can adapt his tactics according to his enemy's situation thereby succeeds. By the way, enemy here in the wartime, we talk about enemy, but here in our business setting, it's about any of your business dealings, right? Your partner, your manager, employees, competition, and could be your spouses. But by the way, spouses, enemy, pretty close. <laughs> do we have any divorce attorneys in the house? We don't? Okay, do we have any attorneys who have been divorced in the house? <laughs> You know what I mean. Okay. Inspirational, I guess, is the best word, and I had a little bit of a tear in my eye about it. I thought it was super and a great way to begin our session. Raise your hand up, make a circle clockwise, right? And you go down, 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 under your eye level. And what she is trying to do to motivate people, uh, which she is phenomenal at, by the way, uh, is, is, is astounding. There are five elements that govern success and must be understood by every general, every leader, every each and every of us here. They are Dao, Tian, Di, Jia, Fa. Dao, your moral standing, the motivation that drives your action. Tian, your timing. Di, your terrain, your resources, what you have. Yeah, your leadership, quality of a leader, the state of mind. But how do you execute it? Your management, your method of execution. I think her uh, principles are very inspirational, and um, I think everybody found something important in what she said and something that they can use in their daily life and in their business. Your strengths could become your weaknesses, and you can turn your weaknesses into possibilities. How many of you here, at a certain point in your life, you feel that way with your business, with your practice, with your personal life? <laughs> in the Art of War, it says, success lies in the ability of a leader who could comprehend and appreciate the power of the situation, rise above a situation by creating, leveraging, and adapting to the emerging and current environment. Use your regular formations to engage the enemy. Use your surprises to conquer them. So, what are your surprises? One of those kind of content rich presentations that just makes you think and learn. And when you leave the place, you feel like you're just a little bit better than you were when you walked in. I'm looking forward to her book.